I was in junior high school, started working in a clothing store. And I really got that job, number one, because I needed money to buy clothes and records. I remember getting some great clothes and wearing them to school in junior high school and numerous girls like commenting on my look and everything and then I became obsessed. I gotta make more money, I gotta work more hours, I gotta get more clothes because this is my way. My career path has been, uh, as I guess the, the Grateful Dead said, a, a long strange trip it's been. I was like a lot of kids when I graduated from high school, I didn't really know what I wanted to do so I thought, I was always good in science, so I'm like, I'm gonna go into pre-med. But I also kind of felt along the way that it wasn't really necessarily what I wanted to do. And still working in fashion, or still working in retail through there, I was actually making more money selling clothes than I was teaching. I just started taking classes on pattern making, even though I'd been working in a, a, the tailor shop in my store and had some education there, was able to sew, I wanted to know more about making the garment. And then one day, I was walking through Barney's New York in 1999, and I saw a lot of black. And I thought, God, what a great time to do something that understands contemporary silhouettes and details, but also understands like the character of old world and vintage and a heritage, and merge the two, because I didn't see it out there at all. Sometimes it isn't even as much as it not been done before. It's how do you do it your way? How do you make something your own with the right fabric and the right finishing, the way you trim it, the buttons that you use, leather, the small things like that that make the difference are much harder than designing something crazy. As we've grown over time, you know, instead of wanting to have my face everywhere behind the brand, my way to do it is to kind of put more into the product tell more about myself through my collaborations, whether it's music or art or whatever, anything that we do, those things tell more about who I am. And I think it's one of the things that we find with a lot of our customers is that they connect with the DNA of the brand. Making something your own and making the customer feel like they've, that they bought something special and unique and enduring, that's, that's my goal in life.